had a great meeting yesterday, as you know, with the Prime Minister. And I think that uh, as far as Pakistan is concerned, India, they're talking. I'm certainly willing to help. I think they would, in a certain way, like my help, but they have to both want it. Uh, they have very different views, and I'm concerned about it. On Iran, I think we're doing very well. Let's see what happens with Iran. But we are uh, ver we're in a very strong position on Iran, and I think they'd like to do something, and I think it would be a smart thing for them if they did it. Reaction to the Washington Post a story about you supposedly asking um, and withholding or holding the funds and aid for Ukraine. And the second one is you meeting tomorrow with Venezuela, um, with leaders of Latin America to talk about Venezuela. Nicolas Maduro said that if the United States changed the policies of Obama, they, they will meet with you and they would love to have talks. So here's the story very simply we're watching Venezuela very closely. As far as withholding funds, those funds were paid, they were fully paid. Uh, but my complaint has always been, and I'd withhold again, and I'll continue to withhold until such time as Europe and other nations contribute to Ukraine, because they're not doing it. It's the United States. We're putting up the bulk of the money. And I'm asking, why is that? And I want Europe, and it's always been this, and everybody knows it, every single reporter knows it, everybody in the administration knows that what I want, and I insist on it, is that Europe has to put up money for Ukraine also. Why is it only the United States putting up the money? And, I, and by the way, we paid that money. But I always ask, why aren't other countries, in Europe especially, putting up money for Ukraine? <laughs> I think it's ridiculous. It's a witch hunt. Uh, I'm leading in the polls. They have no idea how they stop me. The only way they can try is through impeachment. This has never happened to a president before. There's never been a thing like this before. It's nonsense. And when you see the call, when you see the readout of the call, uh, which I assume you'll see at some point, you'll understand. That call was perfect. It couldn't have been nicer. And even the Ukrainian government put out a statement that that was a perfect call. There was no pressure put on them whatsoever. But there was pressure put on with respect to Joe Biden. What Joe Biden did for his son, that's something they should be looking at. <laughs> Because very important, very important, I want other countries to put up money. I think it's unfair that we put up the money. Then people called me, they said, oh, let it go, and I let it go. But we paid the money. The money was paid. But very importantly, Germany, France, other countries should put up money. And that's been my complaint from the beginning. <laughs> Well, we're going to see what happens, but I think Iran is coming along well. Regardless of what happens, we're in very good shape with respect to Iran. Okay? <laughs>